Smoothies are a convenient and tasty way to get nutrients into your system. There's little preparation compared to other meals, which leaves you more time to spend with your loved ones. I want to show you how I make one of my favorite smoothies. I have this almost daily along with other fruits and vegetables. It's 100% whole foods and nutrition packed. I also wanted to show you that you don't need to add powders and paste to get the nutrition you need. Chronometer is a great free website that allows you to track the nutrition you're getting from the food you eat. According to the results, this meal totals 1,045 calories. This is important because as a breastfeeding mother, you need to be consuming around 2,500 calories per day. Also, in terms of nutrition, this meal equates to 49% of my daily needs according to my height and my weight. Chronometer also breaks down all the nutrients, minerals, fats, etc., which is also important to know. If you're interested in this information, feel free to pause on the section as I scroll down. Okay, now to the smoothie. Let's go through the ingredients with my trusty assistant. I've also listed the key nutrients of the ingredient on the screen. Five bananas. For many, this might sound like a lot, and for some, you might even be scared of getting too much potassium. But realistically, this amount provides me with less than half of my daily recommended intake, so no need to fear. For me, having more bananas provides me with the fibre and calories I need to make myself feel full. Five dates. Dates are a great natural sweetener. I sometimes use them in place of where I would usually use sugar. They're also great snacks on the go. My daughter is a fan too. One and a half cups of blueberries. Blueberries are rich in antioxidants and in terms of flavor, I feel like they are one of the few fruits that freeze well and don't lose their flavour. One bunch bok choy. Now this may be new for some of you, but it's worth trying. Bok choy is packed with nutrients, but also has a fairly neutral flavour, unlike other greens, which can be off-putting for some. And last, one and a half cups of plain water. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you give it a like. And if you'd like to see more videos like this, hit that subscribe button. Thank you again for watching and I look forward to seeing you next time. Bye.